Well, thanks for visiting us this morning at KTALnews.com as well as your Weather Authority app. I'm meteorologist Josh Marses, and this is your Friday forecast update. We do have some clouds uh, returning to the Arkletex today, and that will eventually result in some light rainfall, especially for the northern Arkletex, and that chance of some lightly scattered rain will be around through the weekend and actually much of next week as well. So the clouds will be a thing for us, but you'll notice today the temperatures uh, running warmer as we should make it into the 60s and 70s this afternoon afternoon so uh, we shake the cold air for a day but the rain does return so if it's not one thing it's definitely another but you can see uh, some of those showers ongoing here in northeast Texas these will affect Texarkana this morning so there will be some uh, light rain passing uh, over the region here which will result in a few wet roadways for the morning commute but if you're looking to do things outside we've been talking all week it, this would not be a washout for us today uh, or over the weekend and it definitely won't be so you'll still be able to squeeze in those outdoor plans but just know you could see a uh, 10 to 20 minute rain shower at uh, any point today and uh, likely on Sunday as well especially in the northern Arkletex. So uh, wide view the region we just have this little weather disturbance that has developed here in Texas and we're just kind of on the fringes of that which is why we're seeing the rain today and then tonight we've got a uh, cold front on the way here which will push some additional light rain through the region and cool a few locations down as we start out the weekend but our temperatures running uh, pretty mild for early December we're in the 40s and low 50s here this morning even with the clouds out there we should uh, warm about 15 to 20 degrees today so that should push us to about 68 in Texarkana 70 for Shreveport just great temperatures today but the trade-off is uh, not a lot of sun out there as we'll likely see the clouds and that chance for light rain persist uh, especially through the morning so looking at Robin's Toyota future cast you'll notice the rain will continue to hug the I-30 corridor here probably won't see a lot of rain in Shreveport or Natchitoches today but late tonight you'll see this front begin to get kicked through here so uh, likely will be some light rain showers overnight and if you're looking to do some things around sunrise tomorrow morning uh, will be some rain here across the south end of the Arkletex but we'll dry out tomorrow Shreveport we may be stuck in the clouds for much of the day but you can see the clear skies in uh, Texarkana as we go through the afternoon and then uh, on Sunday we've got uh, another chance of rain developing in the northern Arkletex so kind of get the idea the weekend won't be a complete washout but yes we will have some rain out there at times especially uh, today tonight as well as Sunday so look at your lows tonight which will actually be pretty mild as well uh, 50s and 60s for most of us and you will notice there is a temperature drop tomorrow so Shreveport will probably uh, stay right around 70 degrees or so but those locations that clear out in the northern Arkletex will really feel the uh, cooler air drop in for a day here as we'll be in the 50s as well as the low 60s but again should be just fine to get outside uh, through the weekend here now as we head into next week we've got another warm front on the way Monday and Tuesday so that will uh, keep that chance of some light rain going highs in the 70s here and then we have a cold front that will actually stall across the region next Wednesday Thursday and uh, maybe even into late next week as well so we will see that chance of rain increase especially by the middle of next week but uh, looks like a lot of rain on the seven day but uh, all told here next seven days most of the forecast models showing about half an inch to maybe an inch or inch and a half of rain which is uh, again in the grand scheme of things not a lot but uh, we will see those showers on and off for much of next week as well.